second year students try to read the question which is asked in 2017 the resistance of a wire is taken as r ohms i have taken it as r ohms here if the it is melted and stretched to n times means l1 is equal to l l2 is equal to n times of l okay so how are we going to solve this problem let us see here one thing is common here that volume remains same in both the cases that means v1 is going to become equal to v2 and volume is going to be equal to area into length here and we all know that resistance is equal to rho l by a and here you can write area is equal to volume by length so resistance is equal to rho l by a a means you'll write v by l that is v square v by l square so resistance is going to be equal to length square therefore we can write r2 by r1 is equal to l2 by l1 whole square this implies that r2 by r1 is going to be equal to l2 is taken as n l and l1 is taken as l whole square so ll gets cancelled here you will be getting r2 is equal to n square times of r this is going to be the simple solution for this problem so your b option is going to be correct here thank you very much